Hi, I'm Ted Greenfield with Let's Play Politics, where we take a look at the latest in the worlds of politics and football. From the Voice of America studios in Washington, David Beckham exits Major League Soccer in big style, winning another MLS Cup with his team, Los Angeles Galaxy. Beckham praised his team's spirit. You know, good teams and good character in, in teams uh, come good at the right times. Um, and I think we showed that this year. This message applies to political Washington as well. Every family in America will see their income taxes automatically go up on January 1st. If there is no agreement between President Obama and congressional Republicans by the end of the year, the average American family will be paying about $2,000 a year more in taxes. The tax increase will be accompanied by billions of dollars in automatic spending cuts. Though initially there was hope that President Obama and congressional Republicans would be able to resolve their differences, the negotiations have taken a turn for the worse. Republican John Boehner is the Speaker of the House of Representatives. Right now I would say we're nowhere. Period. We're nowhere. At the center of the controversy is President Obama's push to raise tax rates for wealthier Americans. Democrats insist on a higher tax rate for that group, but Republicans say that taxing them could have a negative impact on job creation and the economy in general. The leading football world body, FIFA, is tackling controversial issues too. At the recent FIFA meeting in Brazil, two European companies introduced systems to determine when the ball has crossed the goal line. Of course, there is no similar technology for crossing the line in the political world. Hard decisions and their consequences are left to political leaders to deal with. That's all for today. Join us next time for Let's Play Politics.